so Brad, obviously, obviously disappointing. One of the things that uh, Christian just talked to us about was um, how high our XG has been, and, and that you know Charlotte's XG in this game was um, above Toronto's. Um, obviously, you had um, a couple of those chances right in front of the goal. Can you can you take us through you know through that and um, how those were created and, and uh, you know getting those chances tonight? Yeah, I mean, <clears throat> I think it's just our defensive shape, how we press. Um, it made it made it tough for them to to play out. I thought we dominated most of the game. Um, you know, obviously it's a bummer. We, we didn't do the most important part, which is scoring goals. But um, overall, I thought we played well. I like you said, I thought we created a lot of chances. Um, it's just that final ball that that we got to execute on, and we all got to get better at. here at home uh, with uh, Charlotte starting off very strong at home. What has changed, you think, in these last three games that the team just can't get over the line when they play well? Man, I, I really don't know. I mean, like you said, like I thought we played well uh, today. You know, I was just saying, like, that final ball, um, maybe a couple of balls bouncing our way. Um, and then I, I really, I mean, I can't put a... I really don't know. I guess what can we expect these next six games? Because it, it's starting to look like playoffs is becoming out of reach for this team. Do you feel like that? No, I don't feel like that. I mean, like you said, we got six games left. A lot can happen in six games. Um, you know, we should have some guys uh, back with their visas uh, that could, that can help us. Uh, I mean, everybody everybody is still fighting. Everybody still very much believes we can make playoffs, and. Everybody's going to give it their all to, to try and achieve that. Um, that's still our focus. That's still what we're fighting for. And I mean, we just we got to figure it out, and we got to figure it out quick. Uh, Christian said after the last game, he thought maybe you guys were playing a little conservative, almost like you didn't want to make a mistake. But then he said tonight he thought y'all played freer. I mean, do you sense when the game's going on that y'all you might have been holding back a little bit and afraid to make mistakes? You know, try to work through that. Uh, in this game, no. I mean, if you look at the, the two first halves of the last two against New York and Orlando, um, we were definitely conservative. Uh, we kind of let them play with the ball. But in the second halves, uh, we, we, we kind of played like we did the whole game tonight. So, you know, we put, we put a complete game in terms of how we, wanted to, how we wanted to defend, how we wanted to press them. And I thought we did a good job at it. Um, but, yeah, I mean, he, Latanzio is right. Like, we played a lot more free tonight. And, and we started in the first half as opposed to, you know, starting in the second half in the past two games. Um, so that's, that's a positive to take away. Um, but, you know, like, like I said earlier, like we, we need to score goals and we need to find ways to get three points. You know, they finished, you know, two, two of the very few chances they had tonight and, and we didn't uh, finish our chances and we got punished for it. So off, to off topic uh, from tonight, but um, tomorrow you, you've got a big event and, um, you know, not only one of the hardest working guys in the field, but it seems like you're one of the hardest working guys in the community. Um, I know, obviously, you'd much rather have a win, but um, how's it feel to, you know, be able to do so much to give back? Yeah, I mean, I was saying, I was saying earlier, you know, the club doesn't have to, have to do everything for us to give us opportunities in the community. Um, we have, we as players we have a we have a big platform that that we can take initiative on and and do things on our own and and that's what I that's what I uh, I try to do you know I mean Charlotte is a special place to me and and I want to do as much as I can to give back to the community and uh, and be a be a special part of this so uh, we're starting we're starting that tomorrow and uh, we're all uh, we're all gonna have a good time and and raise money for a good cause. Thank you. Very much. Thank you.